Good evening, everyone. This is Primetime News. I'm Bradley Safer, and I'm filling in for John Schuss while he's on vacation. On July 4th, during the festivities, a tragedy happened on the streets of Chinatown. A female toast was shot by a stray bullet. Jonathan Newman has the story. It was a reunion that drew Miss Ron Lantine to the New York area. A chance to mix with old school friends from the Philippines, trade memories kept on too many years apart. It was also a chance to see town, take in theaters, watch the fireworks explode over the New York Harbor on a warm, beautiful night. The best kind of things the area has to offer. But a bullet ended all that. It just happened. At 11.30 p.m. Thursday, as Miss Lantine and friends were driving north on a Chinatown street, headed for a late night snack after the mammoth fireworks display, members of a notorious Chinatown gang, the Ghost Shadows, began to fight, the police say. By the time the car had reached the crowded intersection, the dispute had become a gun battle. Gunfire erupted and a bullet hit Miss Lantine, sitting in the passenger seat in the head. She died yesterday at 8.50 at St. Vincent's Hospital. The police now believe that the bullet which killed Miss Lantin was fired during a dispute between rival factions of the Ghost Shadows, a notorious Chinatown gang reportedly involved in a number of crimes, including extortion, robbery, and the protection of illegal gambling houses. In their search for clues, the police have come up empty. No witnesses will come forward. In the past, it has been increasingly difficult to bring witnesses forward to testify against gang activity in Chinatown. This is no exception. This is especially troubling for police in light of the recent gang activity caused by a new influx of Chinese and Asian immigrants to the area. This is Jonathan Newman on the beat in Chinatown. I was there on the night of July 4th, trying to take some pictures of the night scenes in Chinatown. It was dark. I used a wide angle lens and set the exposure at one second, or sometimes two seconds, to see what I could capture. Here, in this picture, I got something interesting. There are two guys. They're moving. And they stop. And there's a flash. Uh, some kind of explosive came out. And this guy on the left, he looks like a friend of mine, Johnny. He really looks like him. Is this Johnny? What was he doing? What was the flash?